Today, two local high schools look to advance in Lakeshore Public Media's annual academic tournament that we call Making the Grade. Who will move to our championship round in this semifinal match? Will it be South Central? Or Andrean? We're just moments away from this semifinal edition of Making the Grade. Program support comes from NIPSCO. Honey, who is this guy? Oh, that's Frank. Hey, Frank. <laughs> I mean, why is Frank in our bedroom? He's showing us ways to save money. Plus, he'll even help us install LED bulbs and new shower heads. Oh, well, he is leaving before I shower, though, right? To schedule an energy assessment and learn more about energy usage, visit nipsco.com. Frank, could you hand me a towel? Lakeshore Public Media and Making the Grade are supported by Chick-fil-A, proudly serving our Northwest Indiana community, helping to support education and developing young minds. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, located in Merrillville, in front of the South Lake Mall. It's season number seven of Lakeshore Public Media's annual academic tournament that we call Making the Grade. Hi, I'm your host, Andy Schultz, and today eight of the best and brightest students in Northwest Indiana look to advance their team in our tournament. Advance, in fact, to the championship round. This is a semifinal contest in our tournament. The ultimate prize, the Making the Grade championship trophy and scholarship money provided by NIPSCO. Who will advance to the championship round? Will it be South Central? Or will it be Andrean? We'll find out as the game goes on, and we'll have a chance to meet our contestants a little bit later in the show. But we're going to get this game started right now. A semi-final edition of Making the Grade starts at this moment. A five-point clue coming your way in our first round that we call Question and Answers. Pretty simple. I give the questions, you give the answers. It's five points for a correct response and no penalty for an incorrect response. Hands on buzzers, here comes your first five point clue. In 1949, American artist Robert Motherwell began his most famous series of works, an elegy to the Republic of what European country? Paul from Andrean. Korea? It is not Korea. Liam from South Central. France? Not France, we were looking for Spain. No points awarded there, here's your next clue. In physics, if two capacitors of six microfarads are connected in series, the total capacitance is what value? Catherine from Andrean. Six. It is not six. South Central? Nicholas, just in time. Uh, three. Three microfarads is correct. Five points for South Central, and you're on the board first. Her diary recently got another 35 years of copyright protection in Europe after her father, Catherine from Andrean. Anne Frank. Anne Frank is correct, of course, speaking about the diary of Anne Frank. And Andrean on the board now. Name the specific style of window covering sold in both vertical and horizontal versions whose main types include roller, Roman, pleated, and Catherine from Andrean. Blinds. Blinds, yes, or Venetian. Five more for the 59ers. Next clue. George Washington chose the area where Washington, D.C. now stands that borders on what river? Paul from Andrean. The Potomac River. Potomac is correct. Five more for Andrean. You're up to 15. Which Dr. Seuss character speaks for the trees and fights? Paul from Andrean. The Lorax. The Lorax fights against the Onceler as well. 15, or pardon, five more for Andrean. Some think his crime was secretly marrying couples. Name this patron, patron saint of lovers, thought to have been executed in the late Paul from Andrean. St. Valentine? St. Valentine, yes. Five more executed in the late 3rd century AD on February the 14th. How appropriate. 25 for Andrean. Here's your five point clue. Everybody hands on buzzers. Located where the Salt and the Gila rivers merge, it was once part of New Mexico territory. Its landmarks now include Sky Harbor International Airport. Name this capital of Arizona. Nicholas from South Central. 
So Sorry. Phoenix. Phoenix is correct, yes. Five more for the satellites, and you trail by 15. Name the object that creates solid objects one layer at a time from instructions. Paul from Andrean. A 3D printer. 3D printer, correct. Instructions in a software program. That is correct. Five more for Andrean. You're up to 30. Give the most common adjective used to describe the set of pronouns. My, your, Paul from Andrean. Possessive? Possessive pronouns, correct. Five more for the Niners. Named for a Danish explorer. What part of the Pacific Ocean is north of the Aleutian Islands and separates Alaska from Russia? Liam from South Central. The Bering Strait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to a ruling for it. We're good? Okay. Bering Sea, but they took Bering Strait on that one as well. Five points for South Central. You trail by 20 after our first round of play, but there's more game coming later. We'll pause the game and take a moment to meet our contestants. Starting on the South Central side, and I'm talking to Izzy, who's a sophomore. And uh, all of our contestants fell out a, bio, a little bio sheet. And you wrote this quote, I want to change the world. Pretty simple. What do you, what do you want to do to make the world a better place? I want to help people. Good. How do you want to do that? Do you know? Um, well, I want to do business field, but I want to help people in a way that others can't. That's good. And would you be willing to help your favorite bands? Because you also indicated that you spend time obsessing over your favorite <laughs> yes. bands, too. That's good. I'm glad you were willing to admit that as well. Yeah. Izzy, good to see you again. <laughs> Thank you. And uh, to the whole South Central team, uh, good luck the rest of the game, and congratulations on getting to this point. Ben is a senior and a newcomer to the show, joining the team here in their third game. Your favorite sports team, the Chicago Blackhawks. Now, at the time of this taping, they were just recently eliminated in kind of a shocker in the 2017 NHL playoffs. What happened? I have no idea. It's an embarrassment. <laughs> <laughs> it's tough to watch, right? Yeah, horrible. Do you have a favorite player? Um, probably Jonathan Tays. Yeah, that's good. Great leader. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's what you like about him. That's, I feel like, a pretty common theme. Ben, yeah. good to meet you. Liam, a senior at South Central. And uh, you enjoy fishing mm -hmm. and reading the newspaper, correct? Yes. Which of those two uh, excites you a little bit more? Well, they're both relaxing, I would yeah. say. Yeah. I don't get to fish as much, so th going fishing definitely excites me more since I read the newspaper every day and kind of get used to it. Yeah. Is it always yeah. good news or bad news? or? It's, it's Chicago Tribune, so you, you don't really know what's going to be in there. <laughs> <laughs> good insight, Liam. Nicholas, a senior at South Central, and you have to explain this to me. You're a member of the Moose Krause chapter of the Football Hall of Fame. Tell me about what that means. Uh, well, the foot I was inducted. Uh, a few weeks ago, or no, just like this last week, sure. into the Moose Krause chapter of the Football Hall of Fame, and that is a, you fill out, your coach nominates you, mm -hmm. and you fill out a scholarship, and it's for scholastic excellence yeah. while being able to perform uh, on the field in a higher than average. Great. Congrats on the honor. Sounds like a big deal. Do you get like a bronze bust with your head on? Uh, <laughs> no, but we, I get a we get a little plaque and we get to That's meet awesome. some guys. Like uh, the guest speaker there was a uh, Notre Dame former Notre Dame player who nice. was being inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame. Very cool. Well, congrats on that honor. South Central, congrats on getting to this point. They are coached by Dave Horn. <laughs> Talking to Andre and Junior Paul. And among many talents that you have, which we've highlighted on the show yes. so far this season, you're also involved with the theater. Yes. You on stage, behind I, the stage? Really, I've really done like, both, but okay. um, primarily I've been the stage manager for the, la for the last show, which was Shrek the Musical. So okay. I had the job of managing 39 actors, which was fun, sure. to say the I'm least. I'm sure it was always smooth, right? Oh, of course. No None. shouting or no, fighting at all? No, no, no shouting, no yelling at <laughs> actors. Everything went perfectly. Awesome. I can totally believe that, Paul. Danielle is a senior at Andrean, and this is your quote from your bio. I have a metal plate in my head, so I'm basically part cyborg. Basically, yes. Okay, so <laughs> um, do you have a hard time going through metal detectors? Or, Not uh, really. It's really weird, because I thought that I would, because, I mean, I've had it in my head since I was 10, okay. and the first time I went through a metal detector, I was actually at Sears Tower, and I was waiting for, like, policemen to come and be like, yeah. you're terrorists, and no, nothing <laughs> happened. Fine. I'm glad that worked out <laughs> a little smoother than you might have thought yeah. it was going to be. Thanks, Danielle. Good to see all of you guys again. <laughs> that's, a, that's one of my favorite stories on the show. I like that. Tom is a sophomore at Andrean. You got to top this story, okay? Um, 
you play video games, you're on numerous academic teams, you're also a part of the theater, so mm -hmm. you're obviously consumed with a lot of time, but I want to ask you about yeah. the video games specifically. You like newer games, you like retro games, kind of what's your... Uh, it's a bit of a mix of both. I like to play the classics, like yeah. uh, Zelda's Ocarina of Time, maybe Majora's Mask, but Overwatch is a lot of fun too. Cool. I spent a lot of time playing the event recently, as of the time of this filming. All right. Yeah. <laughs> at the time. I like that. I, I, don't know for, I don't know if we're allowed to date uh, filming, but there we you go. You can, sure. Might, might as well. We talked about the Blackhawks uh, yeah. failing miserably earlier. So, <laughs> Catherine is a junior at Andrean, and you are part of the yearbook, the yes. newspaper, and various academic teams, and part of the student council. So like Tom, you're pretty involved. Which of those clubs do you feel like you excel the most in? Um, probably the academic teams, just because... Because you're here. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Definitely, but uh, yeah, we work really hard in those, and that's probably what I spend the most time out on out of everything. All right, well, very good. Congrats on getting to this point, Andrean, and good luck the rest of the game. Andrean is coached by Jacob Knazer. <laughs> Continuing on in our game with our second round of play that we call Pop Quiz. This is a one-on-one -on -one competition. It'll be Catherine versus Nicholas, Liam and Tom, Daniel and Ben, Izzy and Paul, and then we'll cycle back after those first four questions. Still worth five points apiece, still no penalty for an incorrect response. First clue for Nicholas and Catherine. Ruth Younger and Joseph Azagai are characters in what classic play by Lorraine Hansberry? Catherine from Andrean. A Raisin in the Sun. A Raisin in the Sun, yes. Five for Andrean, you are up to 40. Tom and Liam, this one is for you. Today, it may be topped with whipped cream and cinnamon. Identify this coffee drink named for its color that resembles Liam from South Central. Cappuccino. Cappuccino is correct. That resembles the hood of a monk. Correct. Five points for SC. Ben and Danielle, this one is for you. Within 100 years, name any year during the reign of the Mongolian conqueror Genghis Khan. Ben from South Central. 1242 is correct, yes, all right. I, I had to like look at the range there. Look at that, yes, thank you. Anything we would accept, anything from 1106 to 1327, so I'm just doing some not very difficult math. All right, five points for South Central, that's easy math too. Izzy and Paul, this one is for you. What ancient Greek structure was dedicated to the goddess Athena? Paul from Andrean. Parthenon. Parthenon is correct. The Niners back on the board again, you're up to 45. Catherine and Nicholas. Lord Carvarnan, pardon, Lord Carnarvon gave him one last chance in 1922 to find the Egyptian tomb he'd been looking for. Name the archaeologist whose finding of that tomb has made him almost as famous as Tutankhamun, the king he found. Howard Carter, Howard Carter. And that is it for our second round of play. Andrean right now leading 45 to 25, but points of plenty coming up here in our next two rounds, our third that we call Class Project. It's group work if you want it to be, but I recommend working on your own for speed purposes. I'll read three clues that lead toward one answer. If you can give me the correct answer after one clue, it's worth 30 points. If I read two clues, it's worth 20, and all three clues, it's worth 10 points. Each team can take a shot at each point level. Here are three clues pointed toward one answer in the category Social Studies, your 30-point clue. After 14 years in the British Navy, he was given his own ship in 1769 to sail into the Southern Hemisphere. Nicholas from South Central. Magellan. Not Magellan. Andrean. Tom. Rally. Uh, incorrect. Here's your 20 point clue. Same answer. As part of that journey, he watched the transit of Venus across the sun from what is now Tahiti. Here's your third clue. It's worth 10 points if you can get it. This explorer became the first Westerner to see the east coast of what is now Australia in his ship, Paul from Andrean. Cook? James Cook is correct in his ship, the HMS Endeavor. 10 points for Andrean, and you're up to 55. Here's three more clues, all pointed toward one answer. Language and liter or pardon, literature and language arts. The 30-pointer, one of his closest friends is Tubal, his fellow Jew. Twenty-point clue: His servant Lancelot Gabo 
leaves him to work in Bassanio, while his daughter Jessica elopes with a Christian named Lorenzo. Ten-point clue in the final one. This money lender's contract to receive a pound of flesh does not include receiving any blood, as Portia points out to him in Shakespeare's The Merchant of Venice. Looking for Shylock. Character was Shylock. All right. Three more clues pointed toward one answer. Science and math. Here's your 30-pointer. Ernst Chain and Howard Florey shared the 1945 Nobel Prize in Medicine for purifying and experimenting with this substance. Liam from South Central. DNA. Incorrect. Andrean. Twenty-point clue. Even when originally diluted 500 times, this substance still killed staph bacteria. Liam from South Central. Penicillin. Penicillin is correct for 20 points for the satellites. And you trail by 10 after three rounds of play. But you have all played the game three times. You know how many points you can rack up here in our final, in our final round called Final Exam. Six categories, five questions each, worth 10, 15, 20, and 25, and 30 points, respectively. We will answer them in that order. The team that controls the board is the one that last answered correctly, except for this first choice, which goes to South Central. You are currently trailing, and you get to decide where we go first. U.S. history. U.S. history. It's a 10-point clue there. This time period ended with the fall of the former Soviet Union without any official... Paul from Andrean. The Cold War. Cold War, yes. Ten points for the Niners, and you control. You can stay with U.S. History for 15 or go somewhere else. Stay with U.S. History. Please. U.S. History, 15. Calvin Coolidge called this president who succeeded him Wonder Boy. Liam from South Central. Herbert Hoover. Herbert Hoover, yes. 15 for the satellites, and you control again. It was King Pitt. U.S. History, 20. Until it was renamed in 1804 for a generous alumnus, this first Ivy League college to accept students of all religions was known as the College of Rhode Island. Nicholas from South Central. Brown. Brown is correct. 20 points for you, and you lead by 15. Yeah. U.S. History. U.S. History, 25. This 1765 law levied taxes without American consent of between three pence and six pounds on every printed paper of the 13... Paul from Andrean. The Stamp Act. Stamp Act. 25 for Andrean is correct. And you're up to 90. Uh, science, please. Science. They're going to go elsewhere. 10 pointer. This weather parameter's absolute value is the ratio of water vapor mass to a combined volume. Nicholas from South Central. Humidity. Humidity is correct, just in time for 10 points. We are tied at 90. South Central. Let's finish up U.S. history. U.S. history for 30 there. This U.S. senator from Wisconsin was censured in 1954 for correctly claiming that communists were working in the State Department. Catherine from Andrean. McCarthy. Joseph McCarthy for 30 points for Andrean. That is correct. Up to 120. Science, please. Science, 15. This is the most common oxidation number of the lithium ion. Tom from Andrean. Plus one. Plus one, yes, for 15. 15 more, you control the board. Science, please. Science for 20. This part of a tooth is the white part you see in the mirror. Liam from South Central. Enamel. Enamel, yes, 20 points for South Central. Back and forth we go. 25 in science. When discussing Newton's second law, F equals MA with circular motion, the A becomes angular acceleration, and the F becomes this quantity. Paul from Andrean. The centripetal force. Incorrect. South Central. Nicholas. Centripetal force. Uh, incorrect. We were looking for torque or T. South Central. Uh, science for 30. Science for 30. Also called paracetamol. This substance that is the main pain-killing ingredient in Panadol and Tylenol is very popular as a fever reducer. Tom from Andrean. Acetaminophen? Yes, that is correct. For 30 more for Andrean. You're up to 165, and you have the board. Starts with M, please. Starts with M, a 10-point clue. This two-word term describes the smallest hourly payment that an employer... 
Tom from Andrean. Minimum wage. Minimum wage, yes. 10 points for the Niners and your board. Starts with M, please. 15 for starts with M. A fancy chocolate dessert made with egg whites and gelatin. Liam from South Central. Moose. That is correct. Moose, M-O-U-S-S-E. 15 for South Central. Starts with M. Your board. 20 starts with M. A Mexican street band with a trumpet, guitar, Nicholas from South Central. Mariachi. Mariachi, a singer and an accordion. 20 more for South Central. We've got a great starts game. With starts with M. <laughs> starts with M for 25. That's all right. Ben Franklin suggested everyone develop this character virtue when he said, avoid extremes, forbear resenting injuries. Paul from Andrean. Modesty. Incorrect. South Central, I'll finish it for you. Forbear resenting injuries so much that you th that as you think they deserve. Liam? Independence. Incorrect. Moderation is what we're looking for. Moderation. South Central. Starts with M. Starts with M. 30 pointer. This chemical adjective means capable of being mixed together. Tom from Andrean. Missable. Missable, yes. 30 points for the Niners. 205, you control the board. We have to go somewhere else. Geometry, please. Geometry, 410. Freeport, the second largest city in the Bahamas, is only about 60 miles from this U.S. state. Catherine from Andrean. Florida. Florida, yes. 10 more for you. Up to 215. Geometry, did you? Geometry. Is that where you wanted to go before? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. That's fine. Okay. So we actually gave the geography 10 point clue. That was my fault. We are now going to geometry. Here we go. 10 point clue in geometry. Sorry about that. In terms of pi, give the area of a circle whose circumference, circumference is 14 pi meters. Tom from Andrean. 49 pi meters squared. Yes, correct. You had to give me the squared, and you did. 10 points for Andrean. All right, we have one clue gone in both of those categories. What would you like to do? Stay with geometry. Uh, stay with geometry, please. Geometry. Here we go. 15. Give the coordinates of the point that is 80% of the way from 315 toward 830. That's hard <laughs> in that short of time. 727, what they're looking for there. Andrean. Stay with, geometry. Stay, with, uh, stay with geometry. Geometry, 20. Find the height of a triangle with a base of 28 units whose total area is 210 square units. Tough to get it in that time. Uh, looking for 15 units. 15. Anybody have that? All right. Yes. Andrean. Uh, geometry, please. Geometry, 25 there. In slope intercept form, give the equation of a line containing the point negative 2, negative 5 that is parallel to the line y equals 3x minus 8. Tom from Andrean. Y equals 3x plus 1. That is correct. 25 points for the Niners. You're up to 250. What would you like to do? I'll finish up geometry. Geometry, 430. Find the value of x if the three angles of a triangle are x plus 21 degrees, 2x plus 39 degrees, and 3x plus 18 degrees. Oh, I'm glad you can do this. Paul from Andrean. X equals 17. That is correct for 30 points. X equals 17. You're up to 280. The lead is one, what was that, 135, I think? 145. 145. No. 135. Go ahead, Andrean. What would you like to do? We'll take geography, please. All right, geography. You're really mean at this time. I mean, I really mean it. <laughs> 15 in geography. This only great lake not to border Michigan is the smallest in surface area and furthest east. Liam from South Central. Erie. It is not eerie. I'll finish it for Andrean. And is farthest east of the five. Paul from Andrean. Ontario. Lake Ontario, yes, for 15 more for the Niners. 295 with a minute to go in the game. 
Stay there. Stay there. Geography 420. This Asian country's karst areas are in the Mekong River Delta. Catherine from Andrean. China? Not China. South Central? Liam? Thailand? Not Thailand. Looking for Cambodia. Andrean. Stay there. Stay there, Stay there please. Geography 25. The country of Andorra is in the Pyrenees Mountains between these two larger countries. Dan or Danielle from Andrean. France and Spain. France and Spain, yes, for a quarter century more. And that is our game. Final score, 320 to 145. Congrats on the run to both teams in our tournament. But Andrean will move on to our championship round to play Chesterton. And you'll have to find out how that one goes on our next edition of Making the Grade. Program support comes from NIPSCO. Honey, who is this guy? Oh, that's Frank. Hey, Frank. <laughs> I mean, why is Frank in our bedroom? He's showing us ways to save money. Plus, he'll even help us install LED bulbs and new shower heads. Oh, well, he is leaving before I shower, though, right? To schedule an energy assessment and learn more about energy usage, visit NIPSCO.com. Frank, could you hand me a towel? Lakeshore Public Media and Making the Great are supported by Chick-fil-A, proudly serving our Northwest Indiana community, helping to support education and developing young minds. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, located in Merrillville, in front of the South Lake Mall. 